Now we look at this, moving average price difference postings without stock coverage. In this topic here, handling invoice and GR price difference, we have already seen how to post the price difference for a moving average price with stock coverage. So when there is a stock coverage, we have seen that the difference is posted to a stock account. So now we'll see the postings without stock coverage. Okay, let me explain the meaning of with and without stock coverage. I'm going to create. I'm going to check tire C to see its balance. Let me change it with and without stock coverage so that we can see both the scenarios. Okay, tire C is maintained using price control V, which is a moving average. Now, look at the plant stock. There are 36 units. Okay, let's just take note of that. 36 units. So let us look at that posting with stock coverage first. I'm going to create a purchase order. To watch the full video, buy our SAP training videos at www.erptraining9.com.